Hi, my name is Ronald Long, and I was the onset violin teacher for the film Chevalier. So the first time I heard about the Chevalier film was through a friend, a musician friend back in the United States. He was auditioning for the role, and because Chevalier was a violinist, um, they needed a violinist to do the role, but they actually ended up picking an actor, and the actor's name is Kelpin Harrison Jr. Um, they approached me because they were needing a violin double. They thought it would be a good idea to have me to play all the pieces and just cut the camera to my hands and um, basically I would wear a wig and the effects would come through and then take my face off and put Kelvin's face on. So after learning all of the pieces, I thought I was going to be on film and the director decided the last minute that he actually wanted Kelvin to play all of the pieces. So I got a phone call and they said, by the way, can you actually teach him? Yeah, okay, go. Good, and higher wrist, higher right wrist. He's a very, very eager person. So he really wanted to learn things very quickly. Um, but I said, just give me two weeks and we're just gonna do slow playing, slow um, open strings and just getting the feeling of the bow because, I mean, it, it takes a lifetime to have a straight bow and that kind of thing, rather than doing, as they say, the wind, windshield wipers. Um, but it's like the least I can do is just try to have it to look like he has proper technique. You know, like you would teach any beginner, um, just said, imagine the bow is a carrot and the rabbit is eating the carrot. So give, give me that to hold the bow like that. And he, he did it. And um, also with the flat fingers, I put a tennis ball in the middle of his hand curved his hand so he could have the, the right feeling on the fingerboard. Um, and he actually grasped it really, really quickly. We were in a room for three to four hours a day. And the first two hours was just playing slow scales, first octave scale and the second octave scale. Um, and we just did that really slow every single day. I would say the difference between someone who's, pl who's played the violin before and an actor who's playing the violin is just exaggeration, really. Um, because when you think about it, like even people who do play the violin, sometimes they don't look like they're playing the violin. Um, they're just doing this and, and you see their hands moving, they're hitting all the right notes, but it doesn't really look like they're doing it. So what I was really stressing to him a lot was to exaggerate everything, literally. So like if you're going up the fingerboard, everything should go like that. If you're going down the fingerboard, go like that. And he did it, and you'll see that in the first scene.